Welcome to this section on the two-part savings system. New proposed government regulations enable this retirement system where contributions to the fund are allocated to two components, a savings component and a retirement component. One third of monthly contributions are allocated to the savings component with the remaining two thirds going to the retirement component. At retirement, the balance in your retirement component is used to fund your monthly income at retirement and the balance in your savings component is your lump sum at retirement. You will be able to withdraw money from your savings component before your retirement in the case of emergencies and subject to certain rules. However, any excess prior to retirement will subsequently reduce your lump sum at retirement. Any balance that you have in your retirement fund as at the effective date that the legislation is implemented will become your vested component. Whatever rules currently apply to your retirement benefit will apply after the implementation of the proposed legislation. On implementation, an amount of 10% capped will be transferred from the vested component to the savings component as an opening balance. This means that the total value of your retirement benefit will be the sum of your vested savings and retirement components. It is important to note that while this two-part system does give you access to some of your retirement savings before retirement age, it is not advisable to use the savings component as a transactional account. All components are still meant to be used for long-term savings towards your retirement. You will only be able to access the money in your savings component if you really must in an emergency. Visit our webpage at oldmutual.co.za forward slash two pot for more details about this proposed legislation. Visit member web at oldmutual.co.za forward slash login to review or update your personal and beneficiary details or access this information via any of our useful and secure self-service options. You can also scan the QR codes on your screen.